guys welcome to real talks with pinks thank you so much for the love i've been seeing your comments your likes your subscriptions so thank you a lot keep subscribing to the channel and sharing so today we have a special guest i want him to introduce himself and then i will introduce the topic of the day that they welcome thank you thank you thank you thank you uh from town of junior king of the south aka yang king that's how, say, that, 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 that's how people say it. That's how you say it. The king of the south, aka okay. The king of the south, aka okay. You, okay. You said it with the hands. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so Tulel is here on the show. He's going to talk about uh, unemployment and how he became an influencer. So we want to delve straight into the topic of unemployment. So the mm -hmm. can you please tell our guests um, what you studied at university and when did you complete? Mm -hmm. Uh, it's it's uh, twenty sixth of September. It's gonna be eleven full years. Eleven years. Yes, yeah. I graduated car twenty sixth of September twenty ten uh, from the National University of Lesotho. It's a public administration and political science. Okay. Bachelor of Arts. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, what were your aspirations, or what did you hope to become after studying? Like I've, I've, like I've always had this, and I've always been good with people. So, I wanted something. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, I loved the like the administrator, uh, you know, political side, uh, political analysts, uh, like positions they were using. Know, but this is why I, I chose the the course in energy, it's a you know, course. That's what I did. Get it because the public administration, and it's a it's a it's a public administration. Okay. Mm. Okay. So tell me, in this eleven years. Have you been looking for formal employment, or what has happened since now? Since day one. You know, you don't leave for leave for my certificate. I got off my transcript. I was out there. I was out there till now. Even though it's a little bit like I'm not there, it's a little bit like I'm now. It's different because okay. I don't do it as much as I did it then because kind of when you're a little enthusiastic, you born on off my CVT and stuff like that. So even life happens. Okay, mm. so let's go back. Right. How does being unemployed make you, make you feel personally, emotionally, and otherwise? Hundred, it's one of the most depressing things ever because uh, you after after a little while when you see people getting jobs, people leaving a job for another job, you know, people buying cars, people building houses, they're getting married, they're having kids, and you feel like your life is stuck because you don't have a job. If you don't have a job, you don't have money. If you don't have money. You cannot do anything basically. So mm. it's it, it's depressing actually. Mm. But when you can fall into deep, 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 deep depression, kind of allows it because mm. everything else is like everything else in and it's like you 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 end up feeling like you are failing because you're not doing anything. Anything on a blue note at a way anything on an hour afterwards, it's not happening. So it's like you're failing yourself. You're failing your, your parents, you're failing your siblings, mm. or like you, your life is it's like a waste. You feel like that too. So mm. It's very depressing. Because mm. so, I can imagine, you see your age mate. I mean, not that we want to compare ourselves, but that, that's how we gauge yeah, ourselves. Yeah, yeah. You see your age mates, you see the people you went to school with getting jobs, buying yeah. big cars, buying yeah. houses, and then you feel like you're stuck. You're stuck. Because none of those things is happening on your side. Mm. Yeah, it's a halabo now on their side. Like they're buying a car, yeah, I can register and I wanted to buy another one and you're like, what? Mm. I'm like, oh, I can get what is it? And of course, if I'm going to say what? Oh, why, why, why not stuff when I'm saying it? It's like, I go to the house, 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 it's mad. So tell us, what you Smart. decided to do when you saw that there was no employment coming up in your country? Mm. I think by default, I'm going to say this because I didn't say I want to start hustling, mm. I want to start, but no, it's by default. Mm. I moved a year ago when I graduated, I think close to a year. I asked him back, I was there because I was hoping I would get a job there because I said, you know, I come from the city, I know. Maybe I'm there, I'm trying to find a job, I'm not finding a job. Then I start meeting people, every time I get like, they would tell me, get me something, I go to to get me something nice. I'll be like, hey, what can I do? 
Even this thing, yeah, I always come home, I always see people the t-shirt, it's a, it's a local, it's a local, it's a local, it's a you know, some nice, nice stuff. So it, it hits me, you know, why not buy this kilo de regisa? Okay. This is where it started. Okay. Yeah, but it's a little bit the t-shirt, it's a man's head from t-shirts to everything else that they sell. Mm. Yeah, so to get export to custom. This is how I actually met you. Yeah. So just for our viewers, there was an entrepreneurship expo, I think, yeah, yeah, at yeah. Masteru Mall. Yeah. And then in one of the stores, I saw those beautiful Lesotho t-shirts and I asked, oh, this looks very pretty, I want to buy. And I think that is when you told me yeah. the story. Yeah. Okay, I remember. <laughs> this is how we actually met. Yeah. So you started selling t-shirts. So I started selling t-shirts. I started selling a lot of products that are high money, that are clothing. Like, okay. like sweater, t-shirts, hats, whatever I could say. But mm. it, it's really a very small scale because how's now any other source of income? Well, I don't know how do you say it? That's mm. what you do. Yeah. You make some money and you start eating. Mm. Everything else. So business anyway it doesn't grow because it's similar to a fellow who works on Yes, yes, yes. It's mm. to mouth. So that, mm. that's how it happened. So maybe... I keep doing it, it even take it some odd jobs. I used to work at a catering company and we had shattered them there, a show at them there, create a body day, quarry, like I used to do that. I like I used, your attitude. Yeah, I used I to like work. I like your attitude, you know why? Yeah. A, a lot of graduates, obviously, I mean, there's this education thing. Once you go yeah. to university, yeah. you don't want to do anything yeah, yeah, yeah. while you are waiting to be employed. Yeah. A lot of us, what do you want to like, say? Like, you know, you don't want to do because like, I work in the case of the case, Starting a can ye see that the part time thing is a key time. It's about ten days, about ten days. I actually used to work at the bar when I was doing more for for a couple of months. Okay, so it's like it's about to be you already put your bottle on because it gets to a point. It has to get to a point more than I want to wear a pint. Yes. If ever you are to survive, I don't want to wear a pint. You want to know what wear that about it? It's a school because yes, it's a school, but something isn't happening. Yes. So. You have a choice. Am I gonna let it be? If it's a gig, well, I fell. If I get a little money to school and get my head, now imagine if I waited. If I get the money now, if I can save it, if I can have any source of income, I probably wouldn't have a wife, I probably wouldn't have a family. I, like, I'll probably be much dumb on a child, but I'll be because I'll be so depressed because they don't have any other source of income. They will save it. So tell me, there's a, it's not an, I'll say for lack of a better word, a nice ending. Yes. Obviously you are still hustling like a yeah, 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 yes, yes. I'm sure you still hope that one day you'll get the job of your dreams. Definitely. But tell us how you got into influencing. I know now you are working with a lot of brands here in Lesotho. Yes. Without naming them, how did you get into being an influencer? Here's the thing. Okay, uh, the social media for me has always been about uh, salvation, fun, the humor. Mm. So, maybe this is why I'm always there. All the time. Every day, all day. And I'm always trying to get people to get there because I feel the same thing I feel because now I think what kept me sane all this time in any one until now, I'll get to a point and then I'll go okay, get on social media and read some fun stuff. It's funny. Mm. It's inspiring. So, maybe I wanted to do that for other people. Okay. So maybe I start making a lot of posts, a lot of photo game, like a lot of stuff, mm -hmm. and then maybe start getting a uh, fellowship. You know, mm -hmm. the buttons are follow, oh. are follow. They follow you because of the interest you want to know in what you talk about, yes. about, the kind of person you are, about what you stand for. Yes. You understand? So maybe it's a valid fellowship. It's not an I never thought I'd be an influencer. Mm -hmm. Because the next time, next time, I got until. So I approach some major company. Hi, come on over and say video mona. We liked it. Mm -hmm. We would like to work with you. I'm like, yeah, like am I getting paid? Yeah, we go far. And they say, no, yeah, of course, yeah, of course, of course, mm -hmm. of course. Of course. Get, get a co contract thing. Uh, they say, no, definitely. And then I'm like, what? Maybe, maybe, maybe I can actually use this thing. Okay, in civility, I'm like, you know. Without changing who I am, without changing my content, but 
maybe this might be the thing mm-hmm. that might work for me. You mm-hmm. know, even mm-hmm. it's a car, so it led from one company to the mm-hmm. other, to another, to another. So mm-hmm. we're still hoping for bigger things, better things. Sit back down, have a good Yeah, yeah. At least it's a bit that, that, that breakthrough. Yeah. I would love to at least I'm there. You understand? I've got to a point where I'm also got to Oh, I have a name on Kilowa, it's and I can say no, Gilaga it's a young mamma guy saying and mamma guy saying the mamma can say mamma. We had a very good relationship, a very good business relationship, you know. Mm. Yeah, this is how we, this whole thing the influencing came about. Oh, okay. So yeah. tell us what are your plans moving forward? Meaning, I mean, as a young person in the suit your aspirations, do you wanna continue in the market? Are you still looking? Um, first things first. Now I will always look for a job okay. because I, I've hustled mm-hmm. and I've, I've, I've realized okay, I can do a lot of things, landing series. I just need to find the type of things. This is how I can find this is how much I'm aiming, this is how much I can make on the side. Mm-hmm. So that I don't know, because it's an experience. So we will gain experience. Being unemployed is an experience for you to survive. Yes, yes. So, so you survive here for 11 years. That means I have a lot of experience. Mm-hmm. I also will challenge you to save it. Mm-hmm. So how I save it? I'm gonna know how I can save it. Because right now I cannot say that we have got cheeky. If we are banking, if we are just paying for fifty thousand, what kind of what do you have? Yes. It goes down to the kind of security. Yes. If I have the security, the kind of I have to say part of the income when you push up to a certain level. You understand? Mm-hmm. So I hope I can save it. But uh, I hope for it. A uh, government at some point in time will come up with strategies say to like oh he eradicate that arena because we have a lot of graduates. We have too many graduates. So it doesn't make sense for now. Why would the government spend so much money to take people to school? If ever but no good changes. No opportunities, there's nothing. Mm-hmm. So I'm hoping more it will to change over time, they will start uh, thinking about us more, they will start Coming up with ways to get like our work from off one of the cities. We need to work with international companies, Kapo, I don't know, the mm-hmm. police or something, but it needs to happen. I wish government to me it's a Kahono Basha. Because I cannot tell somebody now, okay, you should go to school because you won't understand. They're going to ask me, well, now I'm not going to be 11 years old, or nine years old. What do you mean? You will never understand how to get no, that is a safety net. You know, you always have that. Yes, yes, yes. Definitely. You always have that. Most of our in, to our civilians, if we have to we can always work. Mm-hmm. You understand? School is change our mindset. Um, it's our own. Because I don't think any of my guys I would think the same way I do now. That's true. You understand? That's so true. it's it's very hard. How we all we come to country, no, ah, push up. Where school long, then you can come back and do your thing mm-hmm. because they don't understand. It's like no, it's been, it's been eleven years since so I said you're here, you're surviving. Well, why should I? You understand? That's amazing. Yeah. Lastly, <laughs> lastly, before we run out of time, <laughs> yeah. a word of encouragement to other young people who are not working and hustling. Yeah. What must they do? Uh, uh, um, they should know what uh, uh, unemployment. It's not, I say, we'll fail well first. Yes, it's not the end of the world, no, honestly. No, yes. unemployment, yeah, so we'll fail well first. You, you, you always try to find something outside the box, outside this fear, you know, say, be your guy, your guy, it's a, you, you cannot do everything that everybody else is doing. Try to find your thing. Okay. The type of thing you can do and enjoy, because you cannot sell clothes if you don't like clothes. You, you, it doesn't, you cannot sell beauty products in a, how to sell it easy. You gotta do, you gotta do that. You understand? So, fine, they should just, because people do that, because they've lost hope. Don't lose the 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 Blacks of money say it. How can we move money? Say it. Wow, 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 wow. We can shop on your own. We can pay you. I will do it. Why did I pay you that? Because I need to survive. I want to survive. I am hoping for better days. I get. Yes. I'm hoping for the better days. What I'm just telling you, keep over sharp. One day it will just be a story. Every time you learn one, you will be together. That's why you're together. So that's too bad. I never. 
<laughs> you understand? But they should do that. Give a barasha tape or barasha hope. Yeah, man. Amazing. Market it is about 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 we're into a lot of things that we do. Has it been barasha tape? Thank you so much, guys, yeah. for coming to the yeah, show. Yeah, it was really nice. Thank, Thank you so much. Time. Thank you guys yes. for watching. Yeah. This has been fun. It's so easy to <laughs> talk to. So yeah. thank you for watching, guys. See you in the next episode. <laughs> yes. <laughs>